welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you an Ikea haul. I'm really excited about this because, oh my God, the stuff in there at the moment is so cool and they got a massive sale on. Obviously, uh, the social distancing thing made it really difficult to shop some parts because people were just like all crowded round and me and my mum were sort of like standing right back thinking, mm, we'll just wait. But anyway, enough of that. Um, I got some really nice bits and I'm really excited to show you. So I'm going to start with this bag. This bag, guys, was £1.50 and look at the size of it. And it's the rainbow. So obviously you could, um, you could actually utilise this bag into like a, a piece of art on the wall um for pride or for the nhs thank you thing you hang it in your window but anyway enough of that so the first i'm gonna start in this corner Urgh! i got this plant i see this plant in like magazines and stuff and i'd seen it on instagram and stuff like that but i didn't see it throughout the whole of the shop and then obviously you go downstairs into the greenhouse section. I went to the Greenwich one, by the way. So they have the greenhouse section where they've got all the plants, like the live plants. Then as you walk through, they've got all the artificial plants and like the big trees and stuff. Um, so yeah, I found this, which I absolutely love. It's got these gorgeous pink roses. And I was going to buy two. And then I see the price. They were like £9 instead of like the £6 ones I've got hanging up. Um, but yeah, I still, I mean, it, look how pretty it is. I just love it. So yeah, I I bought that. Um, oh, jeez. So yeah, that was £9. I got this gorgeous lantern, which is also, I think, £8. Yeah. I can't even lift it. I know why. Because there's a candle in it. There we go. I wanted this since, I think, last year or the year before. They've had it for a while. Um... And they had it in their, like, in the floral section. They have made this, like, flower shop to make it look like a, like a bistro flower shop. And they had these hanging up from the ceiling and with, flat, like, flowers pouring out of it. And I was just like, do you know what? I really want this lantern. So, yeah, look at the detail on that. It's really heavy because it's got the glass um, all the way around. But... I mean, oh god, it's just so nice. And yeah, it was uh, eight pounds, I think. Um, my receipts are in my bag, so I love it. I love it. Um, I also got some of these candle plates. Now they sell these all year round, every year for the last few years. Um, but they were one pound fifty, and um, I was thinking of making a DIY with them from the Poundland sort of like candlestick stands to raise them up a bit because they're lovely on the tables but then having them raised up you can have uh, other little bits like underneath and around them so yeah I bought two of those so £1.50 each I also got some candles right where's the other candle I think the other candle is in the other bag so I'll just show you the one I got the bigger candle they do these in the small ones as well these were £1.75 and the smaller ones I think are a pound don't quote me on that but I buy this scent every time or the red rose the red berries one but this apple one is just divine it's so fresh and oh so sweet and it just reminds me of fresh crisp apples um I had some sweeties I bought two bags of these and then I ate one whole bag to myself didn't even share um they're just the sweet jellies with raspberry cranberry and forest fruit flavor these are a pound each not too bad, not too shabby. Uh, I've got myself a desk lamp. Um, I wanted the big silver one that sort of like it's got the handle. £17, so not expensive, but so heavy. Like I picked it up in the box and was like, I can't carry that home. That's going to be impossible for me because of all the other stuff I had at the time. So I've got this desk lamp. Um, so the round bit is the stand, so it stands, and then you've got the stick that goes up, and then you've got the the actual um, lamp part. And I bought some. I think that was it was in the sale for two pound fifty. Yeah, which is another reason I bought it. I thought a lamp for two pound fifty. What? 
so yeah and then i got some bulbs to go with it these were sort of on the stand next to it so yeah uh, they were three pounds for two bowls which is really good and they're the led ones as well oh i got some meatball sauce i bought two bags of meatballs and i bought four packs of the sauce because when you go to ikea what is the point in being an ikea if you can't eat meatballs um i got these really cool uh like hanging things but they're the ones that stick with the free um sticky bits on the back so it's a pack of three and they're like the, the chrome they're the chrome ones and they've got like a little lip on them so you can use them for like tea towels ah! you can actually use them for anything that's got a hanger on it i suppose and it's quite deep as well, so you can use it for that, um, for certain things. But this was three pounds, I think. I think. Um, this was eight pounds. This is the thing that just fell out of my bag. Um, it's basically just a plastic uh, container set. But I thought when I get my unit in my bedroom, I'm going to have the deep droner boxes. Well, I'm going to get mine from home base. But yeah. I'm going to have the droner boxes filled with my stuff, but I'm thinking my makeup one, I want somewhere that's not going to dirty the, the box with like makeup and brushes and stuff. So I bought this. Comes in a, a set of eight in there. So yeah, I just showed you. Is it seven or eight? One, two, three, four, five. Sorry, five, not eight. So eight pounds for five containers. Um, I thought that was quite handy. And that's, that's lovely. They're like a like grey colour but they'll be inside a box so I'm not too fussed about the colour of them um, the other thing I got these are 25p each and I I picked up a few let's put that down because they are <laughs> god get down um, they are suction hooks so you stick them to your bathroom wall all your tiles in your kitchen and then I should just get one out but I've got no scissors here um and then a lady next to me she was like I'm just gonna open one and see what they're like so I watched her because I didn't want to get myself into trouble I watched her do it and I was like oh okay okay so it comes like this and then you open it out you've got your little suction cup this goes to waste because I don't, I, you know, you don't need that bit. And then you slide the suction into the back there. And you go down. And then, yeah, you just suction that to the wall. And then that, you just push the, the button at the front and it creates a hook. So I, I wouldn't use it for, like, unsturdy stuff. I, you know, I don't know how much you could put on there. But... I mean, it's just a hook for the bathroom. This is for like the body puffs and stuff. And then when you're not using it, you just put it back in. I think that's really clever. And they were 25p like, instead of a pound. So yeah, not too bad. But um, for now, I'll just put it back in its container. And yeah, I suppose you could uh, keep the container if you wanted to move them about or if you was moving home. Um, or you could use containers in a DIY. Boom, there you go. So I bought four white and two black. Um, the black ones are for the kitchen. Uh, what else did I get? Let's get right down here. I got this. We see this in the sale section in like the decor. Oh my God, I've just noticed my hair, guys. I'm so sorry, my hair is a mess. Um, it's the uh, Design Joanna. I'm not gonna say the other word, but it's just the jewelry tree. And we see it up and then I was like, oh, this is really pretty, mum. And then we see the label and it said a pound. So me and my mum were just like, sold. <laughs> but I'll show you what it looks like. So it comes with this glorious, huge tray. So you could use this for jewellery. You could use it for perfumes. Like, yeah, so many things. Uh, and then it comes with the stand. So that's the stand. And then it comes with the other little bit that goes in the top there. And it comes with the little, um, obviously, nuts and bolts that you need to put it together. But that's what it looks like once it's done. 
so I thought yeah I mean I could put all my uh, like hang my expensive jewelry on this and then just have this on this on the side and nothing else because I I'm trying to declutter my life so I'm buying things that I can sort of put stuff into and not have it on show um yeah I, I kind of need help with that <laughs> so I just have no motivation at the moment so yeah that's the problem but anyway on to the next bag curtains these were on a massive offer for like seven pounds instead of 14 it's two panels they are slot top as you can see but uh, I worked in a curtain department um, when I was younger and I know a way of like just slotting these onto a pole so I'm gonna get some a tension pole tension rod thing from the range which I've already got in my bedroom and the front room and these are gonna go in the girls room but what I'm gonna do because we've already got blackout blinds in there all I'm gonna do is just have one panel draped to one side and on the other window I'll have just the other panel draped to the other side so and they're really long they're 98 inches drop our windows are I think 92 because I've got 90 and they're st they, they hit the floor but you have to raise it down a bit so yeah I think our windows are about 92 inches so these are really long but they did actually come like you can buy the webbing they sell the webbing next to all the curtains that you can take them up but I thought because I'm gonna you know hang them to the side could even use these as their uh curtain tie backs so that's handy um but yeah they're in this lovely lilac color as well and they're really light and really soft so i'm excited to get the girls room complete because they got a new bed the other day um there's the other candle that i got <gasps> just bash that uh i got some body puffs as well for the kids these were two pounds for free um, so not too bad and they come in three different colours which is what I always complain about in other shops because you know you get in the pound shop they sell them in like all different colours but to have the set with three different colours is perfect perfect um, so the last two things I got oh no sorry four things I got this awesome tree that looks like the mandrake tree from um, Harry Potter you know the screaming tree so I bought it. I was just like, yeah, that looks too much like Harry Potter to, for it to go miss. So it's a bit dry at the moment. I didn't get a chance last night to, to, to do it. Um, but I bought this pot as well. Uh, how am I going to show this? Let me just undo it. This is like a silver, just a galvanised pot. Get off. This was £4. Look at that lovely hammered effect so nice and then i thought i'll put this look put some drainage in the bottom this will go in there and then in the future when i come to repot this i still think it will be big enough for the next size pot and obviously yeah it will fit in here still so is that a bug oh it's a little fly i don't know where that's from i hope it's not infected my tree but yeah, I just thought these, and they had these all over the shop, like all over the, the greenhouse part. They had them in every single section, but look at those roots. How cool is that? I really, really like it. So I'm hoping I can keep this alive. And uh, yeah, we'll see. My mum bought one as well, so, but I love this pot for four quid as well. It's really nice. It doesn't go with anything else here, but you know, look at this beauty. Right, so the pot was 175. It's the um, just a normal plastic, white plastic pot. But this plant was three pounds, and I can't remember what it was called. Actually, I'm... let's see what it was called. Oh, Fitonia. It's a Fitonia plant. So I've read up on these. They love to be misted. It's a rainforest plant. Um, I read up on the bus on the way home. So yeah. I'm hoping I can keep this alive. It's so pretty. I can just see a leaf dangling off right now. There it is. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if it's a trailing plant at all. I didn't look at images of it. But it looks to be like it might start trailing. And these leaves, guys, look at these leaves. <gasps> You've got the green with the pink. And they, they had ones that were dark green with like a red uh, tint in them. 
so yeah and I read up like once it starts to flower you need to pinch off the flowers because they're useless for the plant um but yeah the leaves are like got these like fine hairs on them so they're like quite scratchy but I love it absolutely love it it's such a beautiful plant so yeah my new plants to my my family of plants so I'm really excited about that but anyway guys that is the end of my um my Ikea haul uh apart from the meatballs you've seen pretty much everything so yeah thank you for watching and um I will see you in my next video take care guys I love you all thank you so much as always and um yeah see you soon bye